What up, everybody? Cam Bean back again with some more NHL 18. Be a pro goalie playing as Greg Goldberg on the Tampa Bay Lightning. Uh, opening the preseason. This is game two, three, four. Uh, we played the first game. We should have had a shutout. We got stuck in that bullshit uh, stick on the post animation. But, you know, this is life. Uh, sorry, I haven't been getting out videos, you know, every day like I normally am. One, because, like I said before, due to the restrictions of the internet I have here, I do an hour-long video, like, seven days to die. It's going to take, like, 20 hours. These videos take about 10, so, uh, I'm going to have this come out, and then we're going to have, oh, winless Detroit, and then we're going to have, so this should come out today, uh, Probably sometime the next day I might be able to, especially with the weekend, uh, be able to get another seven days to die, then maybe a World of Tanks or something. Uh, and I'm working during the week, so it kind of, that kind of cuts into it as well. So we got a 95.2 save percentage. I will fucking take it. Let me get a little sippy sip my drink. All right. Jeez, people, get on him. That was just way too easy of a shot right there in the slot. But it's uh, preseason. It said we're assured to have a slot. We're obviously going to be the number one goalie this year. And it looked like we took over goal number one goalie duties last year. I don't know if they if it's because they... Salary cap, I don't know if that really comes into play on be a pro. I'm sure it might, but you never know with EA. Uh, uh, of wanting to get rid of the Kucherov, Vasilevsky, I can't remember who it was, the goalie. Um, uh, and then, like, putting their faith in me, of being the next goalie. So go ahead and let me get the starts in. I don't, I don't know what the fuck they were thinking. They shouldn't have. We probably would have made the playoffs had they played the uh, the top goalie. Uh, they had the better overall, but well, now we're 82 overall. We'll probably be 83 soon. Hopefully, we can get a couple extra because I think there's a little XP boost off of the uh, preseason game. So, little, little thumbs up there. Hopefully, we get it. We did a great first game. Should have been a shutout, though, but damn. But we got some pretty good stats out of it. That's all you can ask for, especially in the preseason. There it is, Johnson. Ah! That should have been it. That should have been one nothing right there. But Selvi, you know what I mean? Selvi. They win the draw. And hopefully, uh, over Christmas, uh, I'm hopefully we get some new games. So I'll have some different kind of stuff to do during the uh, uh, for the channel. I'm kind of going back and forth of whether or not to get a uh, escape from Tarkov. I just don't know. Yet. There you go. Look, it's stuck right with him. Make sure no one's in front. Go. Good. Good job. Good D. Take it around the net. Alleviate the pressure. Point back to the point. Back over to Berglund. Damn it. Throwing it up. Throwing it back. Back to the point. Ah, shit. And again, playing on the hardest difficulty. I think it's Superstar. Uh, default settings. I haven't fucked with the sliders at all. And also, I think we're at 246 subs at this point. Oh shit! I just got a part of my shoulder with that. I thought it was going to the right. I guessed wrong, but I got lucky that I got a piece of it. But yeah, up to 246 subscribers. So we're almost at 250. I. That'd be awesome to get there. So thank you for all the new subscribers. Hope you guys like the Seven Days to Die and uh, NHL and the rest of the content on the the channel. A little under six minutes remaining in the period. 
I just haven't been able to do a lot of background uh, to get new tanks and stuff on for War of Thunder and Roll of Tanks and all that. Just because of working and just been a pain in the ass. Having to upload videos and take it forever to do so. Gains the blue line. And they've got it again. Decides he wants the corner. Damn it. Oh, that looked like he kind of would have put it behind the goalie right there. It kind of like glitches through. Oh, you fucking... I've had those. There's like a spot right there in the slot somewhere where it makes you shoot 8 and 10 feet wide every fucking time, no matter what. We got a lot of uh, control and play here. You know, possession play. Ah. Uh. I feel like he's going to dump it. He keeps hesitating to want to come in. There he goes. Oh, last minute. Don't you fucking script some bullshit. Oh. Good, solid defensive play with shit. I was swimming in the crease there. He would have been able to get that shot. It, oh, because it, it does that bullshit where it overslides you. And it pushed me way off to the right, my right side. And that's, you know, you're going to have to give up some of those every once in a while. Just because there's no way to predict when it's going to overslide you, underslide you. You're, you're fighting the game, controls, mechanics, just everything. It should all be skill based, though. There should be no auto saves, you know, auto help, auto a aim, or a save assist, or any of that shit. It should. Damn it. Should be nothing but whatever you, your controller does. So, like, say your right stick, if you don't, uh, they shoot it high blocker and you don't push blockers to the right. If you don't push your right stick up to the right and time it correctly, not just push it, but time it correctly, they score. So if you do it too early, obviously your arm will be out of the way. If you do it too late, penalty shot. I don't know about that. Maybe give him two minutes, but a penalty shot, I don't know about that. I think somebody in Tampa Bay paid that fucking ref. Yeah, he paid me. The guy back there. That's what he was saying. Oh, hide. It won't let me see. Ah, oh, he made the save anyway. Damn. Winning face-offs, but losing them. Detroit seemed to have a little bit more oomph. Here in the second. Not right there, though. Got put on his ass. There you go. Strawman. Up the boards. There you go. Oh, didn't we pick up some some defenseman? Was it Oduya? I think it was Oduya that we picked up. Shit! They decided to come out and take the body in the second. I'm watching that middle. Watching that guy on the left. Okay. Alleviate the pressure. Get it out. There you go. Take it to the head. I know it's take it to the bridge. But... Take a little bridge. Oh, here we go. Mm -hmm. Oh, here we go. Bop, bop, bop. Really, there hasn't been a whole lot of chances this, Good job tying the man up on this the game. We've in. had a few. I think they've had like one, a few good chances. Well. Right, They've had one right there. That was one of those... Uh, I'll just cover it. Fuck that. That was one of those uh, where it sticks me, wouldn't let me slide over. Over nine minutes remaining. Still 
scoreless. All right. Beat him on that one. Offside stops the clock. All right. Sorry about that. Fucking moving some, my speaker back here. It's bothering the shit out of me. Getting in front of my uh, monitor. They win the draw and will now set up Rasmussen the coming down. Let's it go. There you go. Oh, don't skate it right in front. Why the fuck do they do that? The probe up the wing. There it is. Damn. Out of the air. It's a goalie's duel here. Can anybody tell me why it's a bumblebee for the Tampa Bay Lightning? There you go. Yeah. Is it because the buzzing sound of lightning when it generates in like a Tesla coil shit? I don't know. I don't know why it's a bee. I don't like the stars of Victor E. Green. What the fuck is it? I don't know. What's it a more... Yes, oh, fuck. You know, bipedal fucking thing that has like hockey sticks on the fucking head. I fucking hate the... I hate fucking... Mascots. I fucking hate them. There's some places that it, it seems legit for, but fucking not in hockey. What the fuck? I'm trying to think of good mascots. Maybe football? Because, you know, starting in high school and shit, you got your team mascot of your fucking school and shit. Maybe. I'm trying to think. Tennis? No. Golf? You're not going to fuck no. They're not going to have that shit out in the course. Those hoity-toity hot, you know, fucking Scotsmen aren't going to fucking allow that shit to happen when they first graded it. Um, don't worry, I like Scotland. I'm just talking about the fucking, the elites that made that fucking game. Were there elites that made the game? You would think so. Maybe I'm showing my ignorance of not knowing who created golf. I know the Scots did. Scotland did. But... It's a one nothing game. Good clean and when? Control. When did, was it? Like the late 1800s? Got it at the point. <laughs> was it only the rich that could could you know afford to not down. have to work in like Got that pass and can look a fucking uh, industrial? Moves it to the uh, move over. Great save, point blank. Woo. I just pay attention there. I just stopped talking. Uh, that didn't have to worry about working in a factory in the industrial revolution. Having to worry about you know. Sending your kids off and not having them come back and falling into bur you know boilers and getting your hand cut off and not having to worry about mining coal, cave ins and black lung. Was it only the people that could afford not have to do that shit that had the free time to make golf? I'm sure I'm making the my point for me, but I don't know exactly when golf was made and by exactly who. Get off that post like that. I fucking that's what Got, made us a goal. Uh, got stuck on that post. And I didn't want to come off because then it pushes you off way fucking far. And I'm pretty sure I'd give up a goal. There it is. Damn. That was a good shot, though. That was a good shot. Good shot placement. Not that one, though. 0.2 seconds. This is a lot like that last game, and I, it's been a few days since I played. I think we, it was like a one nothing going in the third, as well. And I think we scored two in the third. Careless positioning, go fuck yourself, careless positioning. Ah, all right, nine to seventeen. Come on, Sam Coast, win that shit, motherfucker. Keeps it going up the wing. Oh, broke it up. And want him to get that. I went down to the butterfly because if they get that shot that close, they can sneak it underneath your five hole. So I already go down to try to you know, avoid that situation. It'll still happen. We've had it go through our pads before, so. You motherfucker. God damn it! I should have kept it. But that shouldn't have fucking gone through. What the fuck? Uh, motherfucker. Oh, 
There's the blocker in to go out. We are in position. There's nothing wrong right there. God damn, you scripted horse shit goal. I should have kept the fucking puck, but I... Again, when you throw it to your fucking defenseman, it's a 50-50 chance he's not going to skate backwards to go or skate towards where the puck is. God damn it. I thought he would be able to get it and put up the boards. He should have, but there you go. When EA wants to script that early third period goal to tie the game, I should have even thought about that. I should have just kept it in my fucking glove. Shit. God damn it, fucking move your blocker in to go out. Just because that's a position on the ice where there's it's scripted a goal where a goal could happen on that spot. Gets in. What'll he do? On to a left. Shoots one. I wanted to keep that guy behind me. And a power play. There it is. There's the two-one game coming up. Tampa Bay's two-minute penalty is a minor in the call. They're getting pressure too. They're getting the. They have all the the momentum of the game. They must retreat and start back again. Ah. Nicely into the zone. Blocked away. God damn! I told you. There's nothing I could fucking do about that. I had to cover the man in the front, and all four guys are on the one side, and there's just not much you can fucking do there. There you go, fucking EA. Great job. Called it. I knew that power play was coming. I knew the power play goal was coming. Let's script it. Yeah, fucking A. So entertaining. So fun. Oh, my God. God damn it. Of course, they score three in, what, three fucking goddamn minutes? What the fuck is he? This is superstar. Superstar defense. Let's abandon the man who's crashing the net. Let's abandon my fucking personal responsibility. Just so he can have a goddamn one-timer to go in the fucking net. Oh my god. There you fucking go. And now we can't even hit the fucking net. No, it didn't sound hard. It didn't sound like it even hit shit. Why? Because your game fucking sound effects are fucked. Thanks, EA. And there was like a 700 meg update. Good job fixing that EA Sports Online bullshit and not fixing anything else. Fucking fucks. Enjoy that $3 billion fucking windfall. Tampa Bay is in their own end, carrying it off. Or not windfall, what is it, it's fucking, uh... Pass up the middle. Well, either way, the fucking three billion dollars you lost because you greedy your fucks don't want to do any shit about your games. And finally, people, the masses, have finally fucking caught up to your horse shit. God damn it! There you go. Don't do shit. Shoot it right at the goalie. Oh, we don't get the fucking backdoor tapping fucking one-timers? No. God damn no. Good fucking... Oh, now I gotta watch this goal. I can't fucking skip past it. Good God. At a 95 save percentage. I bet you with what we have here, it's gonna drop to 88. Miss the net. We're down by two now. Still, I don't think we've had a shot on goal since they've scored. That's the end. Good work by Coburn. Pass attempt to Schlemko. No luck getting through. He caught it and he holds on. Fuck it, I don't give a shit. We're down by two anyway. We gotta hurry up and get the fight. I don't want him to get a face off. And get that scripted face off goal. And still nothing. And can't hit the net. Shot had the goaltender beat Doc. He rifled it just wide of the net. Fire 
Good. Oh, I can make that save, apparently. Not the one that's right next to me on my blocker side, but the one where I stretch out and get it with the glove. I can make that one. Go fuck yourself. There you go. Shoot it at the goalie. Don't make him, you know, have to fucking move or anything. And fuck this. We're going to lose. I'm not going to come out when they call me. Good God. If you script that fucking face-off goal, go fuck yourself. Good Lord. Got lucky that was a weak-ass backhand. There you go. And I got a guy that got fucking injured. Go fuck yourself. The goalie's far and away been the best player in this hockey game. He has faced an inordinate amount of shots in this contest. Stopped just about everything. And as a result, he's got to be the Missed the net on our one-timer in front, of course. We fucking missed. Not them. No, good lord, no. And shoot it at the goalie. One bullshit goal where blocker goes in and out, and then two fucking backdoor one-timers I can't fucking stop because nobody wants to get in a fucking passing lane or do more, any fucking horse shit that's productive at all defensively. Yeah, not going in. Go fuck yourself. Look how they're they're so aggressive on their defense. And he skates it back to when they're down. They're not like collapsing down low like they do with me and just let the other fucking team run rough shot. And we still haven't got a shot in like four minutes. Still don't have a shot. There you go, guys. Just hit him. Just check him. Yeah. Don't worry about getting the puck. Skate away from it. St fucking Stamkos. Still without a shot. In the last four minutes. Still without a shot. There you go. There's EA fucking eight, NHL 18. Detroit's coaching staff has to be relieved by the outcome of this one. The losing for now is over. That's what, 15 out of 18? So 15, 18, and 83 Sabres. I bet you it drops down to, or 95 will drop down to like an 88. Because we can't get above 88, and we stay about 86, 88, somewhere right there. Oh, and we went to 83 overall. I don't know if I we were that. So 89, yeah. It's going to drop more, so enjoy that shit. Oh my god, this fucking game. I'm sure we were 82 to start off with. And I think uh, it was our agility went up, so I think that's what got us to 83. So that's going to be it for now. There's our shitty stats as usual. Yeah! Alright, peace. This episode brought to you by JavaWhacked.com, the official sponsor of the Can Bean Dip YouTube channel.